Hello and good afternoon. Welcome to the video then for this Honda Civic. It's a 1.4i three-door with MOT until uh, mid-April, uh, I think the 11th of April 2014, and a bit of tax as well to go with it. It's just landed this very minute. Car's been being used every day by the previous keeper. It's tax until the end of February 2014. Three-door car in red, but unfortunately uh, a bit faded here and there, as you'd expect with a T-Reg car. Um, rear wiper, high-level brake light. Let's run around the tyres. Uh, tyre there, pretty much on the limit to be fair. There's a Dunlop. This one here, uh, getting there, not far off the limit, but still road legal. This one here, better than uh, about half worn. And this one here, uh, about 70-80% um, about to go. So one of the tyres is getting a bit low. The uh, boot lid opens up, have that open. We've got an aerial there, which I assume is just manual. There are two keys with it as well. Have I got the keys with me? Yes, I have. They're in my pocket. So we've got two keys. Voila. The locks are working fine. It needs a bit of a hoover out inside. And uh, I'm sure it will clean up quite nicely. No cam belt on this. I'm pretty sure it's a timing chain on this 1400. Um, so 125, 930. Electric windows, they're working fine. Yep. Now it has got power steering, which is pretty decent. Clutch feels all right, yeah, clutch is good. And we've got air conditioning as well. Now whether that works or not is another story. Owner's manuals are all in there, like so. Doesn't sound like the aircon works, but I'll have just a uh, not the fan down one. It could do it. It sounds like the engine's loading up a bit. Yeah, I reckon it is working. Uh, the screen says there's a bit of damage, which is just down there. Airbag, go check that. So an SRS airbag light. Doesn't look like there's an SRS airbag light. I won't worry too much about that then. At least it's not on. Um, so whether the airbag system is working is debatable. There's normally a little light that comes on and says there's an issue or something, but uh, it's not. It no longer appears to be working. What have we got here? Oh, an ashtray. Spirit lighter, been used slightly, but um, yeah, so the car's good, it uh, drives okay, the clutch is fine, washers, wipers, yeah, all working fine, the rear wiper, yeah, that's all working fine, okay, headlining, seats are in good order, Honda, nice and reliable, drop of fuel in there as well, half decent little car, so, doesn't appear to be any rust in it really, just a few minor grazes here and there, so a little bit of graze there, but that looks like that will polish off actually, that's uh, just a bit of paint on the bumper, so that polish off, and you've got a tyre to put on it probably for the next MOT, so there we go then, we'll leave you with that shot, thanks very much for watching, and we'll speak to you soon, bye bye. Okay, welcome to the history and documents then for this Honda Civic, uh, we can see the car has had six owners from new, uh, T registration, Honda Civic, uh, 1.4i three-door hatchback PLG 1396cc in the colour red and last change of ownership was back in July 2012 and the previous keeper was also called Daqua so we've got uh, two family owners for the last keepers uh, 04 2012 so uh, yep family owned vehicle then uh, owner's manuals and wallet are with the car um, Previous old MOTs are here as well, and the current MOT expires. I had to look it up on the DVLA website, Vosa website here. Um, last certificate issued uh, at 120,714 miles, and uh, is valid until the 11th of the 4th, 2014 test expiry. Unfortunately, it's not with the car. It was here when he came to part exchange it uh, and do the deal, and now it's not in the glove compartment. Life. Maybe I'm missing something, but it will need then a duplicate MOT. And I think they're actually, let's have a look, we can go through here, see if it failed. 
on the, on the last MOT. Uh, scanning through. Uh, yes, it did fail. It had a registration plate not working and an offside stop lamp not working. There were some advisories. Windscreen has damage. Uh, and an offside front tyre, an uh, offside rear tyre, and alignment. Uh, those were advisories. So that was done at First Choice Mechanics Limited in Bristol. There's their telephone number. So that is the MOT side of things. Um, so current MOT then until April 2014. The service book's been nicely stamped up. Let's run through it then. Stamps at 9,000, 17,000. Uh, might have a boy. Pages here: twenty-eight thousand, thirty-seven thousand, forty-seven thousand, fifty-six thousand, sixty-five thousand, eighty-three thousand, and there's a stamp, but no. Oh yeah, mileage: one hundred twenty-five thousand miles in 2013 That was a main dealer, shipping Sodbury Ford, and there's the receipt for it: sixty-five pound for a basic oil service. And there are a few other services here: uh, air oil filters. Ooh, blimey, what we got going on here, Mr. Dakwa? Spent a fortune here, £784 apparently. 735 quid. What was the what was the big thing about that? Maybe you had the clutch done. Hmm, invoice total, 735. I cannot see what the big bit was on here. Change clutch fluid. Hmm, maybe that is. Maybe I'll submit here. This is another bill here, £188. Well, there's a big bill there for something. I'm not quite sure what that was, but uh, it says 735 quid back in 2010. And we've got a few other receipts and bills and things. What's this here? Anything relevant? No, tripping sort of Ford Motor Company. So it has been recently serviced. So there we go documents and a couple of keys as well.